300, what's the deal? It's your folks, Shaka. Wanted to share my thoughts with y'all real quick. So, yeah, I got a few inquiries about this Neek and Dwayne situation. A few people wanted me to get my thoughts on it. So, let's get into it. So, some of you all may know that um, it is being reported that Neek and Dwayne have allegedly broke up. Okay, a lot of the outlets have confirmed that they are no longer following each other and they have removed all of the pictures of them um, together from social media. And so one thing I will say is I'm not buying it. It's a stage breakup because the ones that have passed, you know, it ain't really been a come up for them uh, from what I've seen. And so I think that the setbacks reported are somewhat true. And I expected this anyway, you know, just after I seen a few things. And I'm going to say this to men, you know, if you're in these situations, social media relationships are typically doomed to fail because men oftentimes have to subject themselves to things the woman is just going to never respect. And man, respect is like fuel for a relationship, you know, a top tier relationship. Okay, not a dusty or musty one. Okay, but a top tier relationship, you got to have respect for um, the woman that you're dealing with in order for it to go the long run. Okay, in in order for it to mean anything, in order for it to be beneficial to you, her and whoever under you, you two that come with it. But I got four reasons why their situation uh went bad i believe that it went bad okay and so let's just get into it the first is he never had a situation for her to graduate into and you know i said this on the first video that i reported on neat man to men out there if you don't have a situation that a woman wants to choose into you can expect the relationship to be short-lived okay no matter what status, okay, she is at, what class she is in, if you are interested in a woman, if you cannot offer her a situation that's going to see her being a better woman tomorrow because of your situation, you might as well forget about it. And, you know, in my opinion, Dwayne did not have that. He just really kind of pulled up and became a part of hers, okay, which leads me to the second reason. Um, all of that twinning he was doing, you know, the matching clothes, uh, matching jackets and, uh, doing all that little stuff, matching pajamas and stuff like that. I tell men this all the time, the woman, she might not like hearing it. Okay. But she will respect it in the long run. When you tell her that, look, me and you are different. Okay. When you go on record to participate with her and sending her the message that you and her are the same she is not going to respect you okay women do not respect men that they look at as the same and when you get to entertaining the the matching pajamas and things like that that's what you're telling the woman all right um and yeah and just a side note i thought that it was ridiculous they showed a report of diddy twinning up some time ago with that girl young miami and he looked ridiculous okay that's a 50 plus year old man he's supposed to know better but you know like i said whole nother topic but that's one of the problems clowns like that dude is supposed to be an example but um moving on um the TikToks, you know, kind of goes with the 20, but number three, you know, just kind of participating in all of the TikToks and, you know, just doing all of those little things with the woman and things like that. You know, like I say, you become a fun guy, you know, but she does not respect you as a man. You know what I'm saying? The man that is built to be in a relationship with a woman, a beneficial relationship is not the man that's participating in the social media relationships okay they're two different dudes all right and the next thing 
which is number four, which has a layer of things, acting out to impress Neek. You know, him talking marriage and children, despite no real investment from Neek, was not a good idea. You know what I'm saying? You talking all of that stuff, uh, you want kids, you, you, you want a marriage, and yeah, you might be saying it for social media, but the fact that you would subject yourself to saying such a thing with little to no investment, real investment from the woman, I mean, that wasn't a good look for him. You know what I'm saying? Um, I mean, despite Neek kind of just being his girlfriend and kind of like buying him things and stuff like that, in my opinion, they didn't really have much popping like that for him to be talking <laughs> like that. You know what I'm saying? Just having those uh, type of conversations with a woman, again, that had a past serious relationship with a dude and had a child. You know, when you get with a woman like that, you kind of got to expect a little more out of her before you get to talking the whole marriage and children and relationship type of thing. I think that really shot him in the foot when he was doing that. And then the next thing is... Uh, Part of the acting out to impress Neek, getting into the King versus Neek drama. Okay, he wasn't really shutting it down. He was kind of like speaking for Neek. He was being her voice in that situation, and that was not a good look for him. Okay, primarily because when he came into the game with her, social media really wasn't even his thing. And then we kind of look up and. Not only is he doing this, uh, he was bringing his business with his child's mother online. He was doing a lot of stuff that just was not in his character. And so, I mean, he pretty much just was a passenger in Neek's car. <laughs> and like I tell y'all, man, when you are in a situation with a woman and she's kind of like in the driver's seat all the time, she's not going to take that seriously. And the man is going to start to receive a lot of disrespect that's going to ultimately have him, you know, just having no choice but to walk out the door if the woman does not dismiss him first. OK, and so I'm going to go ahead and leave it there, y'all. Um, y'all comment below. What do y'all think? You know what I'm saying? Do y'all even think it's for real? If you think it's for real, what do you think broke up the relationship? Uh, Definitely like this information or dislike this information hit the sub button and the bell we dropping shit y'all like it's your folks shock of the earth philosopher i'm out it's 300